This is a compact clutch XPOC. It is the L30 ER NSE. The model number is 1769 L30 ER NSE. This is an Alan Bradley Panelview Plus HMI. It is the panel view plus 7. The model number is 2711P-T12W22D8S. And this is a Phoenix Contact MGA router. The order number is 2701875. It is the FL MGA RS-2005 TX VPN The POC IP address is 192.168.0.90 The HMI IP address is 192.168.0.100 The MGA router IP address is 192.168.0.1. We have this white CAT5 cable from the HMI and this blue CAT5 cable from the PUC go to LAN port on the router. To remotely access the HMI from the internet on the router, we will need to connect this WAN port WAN to a Ethernet switch or a router that provide internet connection. On the computer, first go to MGA Secure VPN Client. Turn on the connection to establish the connection from the computer to the MGA cloud. And then go to MGA Secure Cloud website, sign in. Go to Service Targets. Start. In Network and Sharing Center, go to Local Area Connection. To make sure this is set for obtain an IP address automatically. Okay, okay. Close. There is no cable connected to my computer right now, but it still have internet from Wi-Fi connection. In Network and Sharing Center, this local area connection is actually from the MGA Secure Cloud. If I turn off the connection, the local area connection will go away. Let's restore it. Local area connection is back now. We have all green here. Service workstation, service targets, and the tunnel in between. Let's open VNC viewer. Type in the HMI IP address. 
192.168.0.100 We are now remotely controlling the actual HMI from internet. There is no cable between my computer and the HMI. Let's stop it from the computer. It's also turned off from the HMI. Stop it again from the computer. Install it from the computer. Thank you for watching.